కాబట్టి అని అదర్ క్వశ్చన్ ఏ శ్లోక్ సేట్ అగైన్ say it again you said one day <clears throat> that we should have faith in a person whom we honestly believe is superior to us and faith in a person i didn't talk in terms of person when we say that we believe we should have faith in the master this world is his creation and we are serving the master we are not serving an individual pick the individuals are his creation and whoever comes to you uski pukar hai pukar you understand he is yearning for something he seek hame uske liye sab kuch karna hai hai na sometimes you'll have to give protection shelter to a sick person you know that this person is going to be terrible you know the person goes and lets you down on every step you know the koi baat nahi doesn't matter because the lord has asked for it think that's why you are stuck with all sorts of people no you're not stuck you are delighted to serve so when you delight to serve it's not a question of faith you have faith in the master anything that you get in return will be what the master desires not because somebody is giving you a feast that you don't ask for and you don't even seek for it you don't want recognition you don't seek it there is a shlok about it that where they say yadrichha lab santushto whatever the lord gives you you accept it with bowed hands take okay? now dukh mila diya ram ne sukh mila diya ram ne hame to dono tarike se ram hi mil gaya isn't it we get pain sorrow or joy whatever we get the lord has given it to us and so in joy or pain we have only got ram only got the master because hame to ram hi mil gaya so it doesn't matter what we get same similarly dualities dwandva the things that are called dwans dualities which a no common man believes in a vedanti doesn't why he is not bothered about the, about the dualities he says ye ye to are creations of the mind he gives no credence to that he and he says only one thought there is nothing except the master every situation is his creation and everybody is his creation so he can never say anybody is bad he can never say anybody is desirable he doesn't say anything he says all are created by the master and we have met by chance no it has been his will so he accepts everybody and serves everybody now you understand he indulges in the service much more than his own players because he has no time there's so much pain around him he has really no time to go and attend functions where he is going to be declared a very good and a very fine person he has just no time for this thick and even otherwise his habit patterns are different 
he will never go to a place. He never is not even likely to meet people where he is going to be established or somebody is going to say he is very great. No, he is not bothered. He is going to say, Vijatu Rami will go when he has got Bhagavan himself. Why should she ask for pain or sorrow or a joy? What recreation does he want? He is born. Kishine, if somebody gives me pain, he hasn't done anything. It's the master's desire. And he's very joyful. So he is always laughing and taking people non seriously. Everybody is on a stage, everybody has to act his part to perfection. A nasty person is not nasty, he is acting a part. A beautiful person is not be beautiful, he has also been through a cloakroom and is acting another part. What is the difference? He is not attached anywhere. Because in either way, Inko bheja Ram ne. Ram has sent them. And I am, okay, I can only sing the glories of the Master. And he says, Bhagavan sends negativity because he wants to teach me Samatva. Samatva is the first step that a yogi must learn where he lives in equanimity. And that's an integral part and in actual fact becomes the substratum of living in the spirit living the spiritual life and the spiritual way. So naturally he'll rejoice in it. So no situation in the world can come which can upset him. He's not saying that the situation is this person or that person. This person has given me, make, made me unhappy and that person is making me unhappy or happy. He doesn't say that. He says, Bhagavan ni kya hai? And his gratitude to the Lord is infinite. He is grateful to the one who has tried to destroy him and he is grateful to the one who has tried to build him up because He's found Ram in all the situations. That's why he's joyful. Now you understand? Thank you. But to see the Lord in every situation is very difficult. Yes, I agree there. But that's your aim. If somebody sees like that, he's the happiest guy. He doesn't want anything. He doesn't. Why what will he do with anything? He is not interested. He is not interested in a name or a form or anything. He doesn't just don't, doesn't say anything. He will refuse to go to a place where he is going to be established. He is not bothered. He is just not interested. And so he is never unhappy because he has no time. He is doing own service and is serving 24 hours. Whatever he has, he shares with everybody without any thought. So he is a little different person, isn't it? Hamdi.